kicking off our summer zip trips by celebrating all the great people and places in the East Bay. And ahead of our special show tomorrow, we're highlighting a new spot in Uptown Oakland that's now open. All three owners were born and raised here and say the town was the only place they wanted to be. As Claudine Wong explains, it's called Viridian, and the owners say the dessert bar is a tribute to home, heritage, and friendship. Tucked into the spot in Uptown Oakland, the blue-green window of Viridian beckons you closer. People see Viridian on the street like, what the hell is going on in this building? I have to be here. Once inside, you are met with a unique pairing, craft drinks and pastries inspired by the Asian-American experience. It looks like fried tofu, which is great because we want people to be a little confused, a little offended. Welcome to Viridian, a place rooted in home, heritage, and friendship. We grew up around here. We love going to Chinatown as children. Um, my mom actually worked in Chinatown for the longest time. We were friends in middle school. I met him in algebra. He was bad at it, and I was good at it. I think that's when he knew I need this guy on my team when I open up a bar in the future. All three owners are Oakland natives and will tell you they are loyal to the town. Oh yeah, definitely. I have an Oakland tattoo on me. And opening a dessert bar here just seemed to make sense. The concept is popular overseas, but hard to find here in the U.S. Exactly. It makes so much sense. It makes so much sense, but nobody does it. And so they did, but with their own twist. So the artist from Oakland and the neon, a nod to China. Hong Kong. They really get inspired by a lot of Hong Kong films, and I think it's a mix of Hong Kong, but also Oakland art. Definitely the Asian kid in me is like, oh my God. <laughs> We're doing it. Ah! The drink menu is about farm to glass. It's hyper seasonal and it celebrates local produce. For drinks, uh, I'd say the tomato beef is excellent. Uh, it, it, it doesn't look like what it sounds like and doesn't taste what you think it's going to taste like. The desserts are Asian inspired, like tiramisu, but with Thai tea, and the popular chili garlic milk bread. Now that we've learned and like refined it, we can present something that has artistic value but still resonates with us inside. Like my inner fat kid, every time I see like the little rumpo tots, like, yeah! All three laughed a lot as we chatted. They do have extensive experience, but they want this to be fun, which means they can't take themselves too seriously. I am the operations manager, is that right? Yeah, I think I'm the operations manager. So while it starts with this blue-green window in uptown Oakland, this spot is about much more. Viridian is so much of a representation of who we, me, Will, Raymond, and all the other team members that make up uh, Viridian staff. And it appears these three Oakland natives are onto something. Surprisingly lately, we've been getting a lot of people from San Francisco, which I think is hilarious because <laughs> the whole point of us opening is so people didn't have to leave and go to San Francisco. Now people from San Francisco are coming here. I'm like, yeah. Claudine Wong, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Since opening back up, the dessert bar has also grown into a pan-Asian restaurant. They credit an outpouring of community support that brought two chefs who have worked and trained at Michelin star restaurants to the team. And Andre and I were just saying, yeah. we need to go there. I'm going to check it out. It's not yeah. too far from where I live. So it looks awesome. And those guys have an infectious laugh by the way. <laughs> we want to remind you that our summer zip trips kick off tomorrow on the 9. We discover all kinds of great things about the East Bay. It's going to be mm -hmm. fun. That's fun. Yeah. I'm ready for a morning cocktail and dessert. Yeah, right now. <laughs>